Hello and welcome to the Top of the Variety Show, episode 2. I hope it comes out okay. I'm using my phone camera instead that is actually rigged up against a cereal box just so it won't fall off the back of the computer. Hopefully the cat doesn't knock him off. Him. I've just labeled my phone a him, but we won't get into that. Hope everyone's having a lovely Monday. It's quite hot and toasty and there's a mower in the background which I hope doesn't come up. I've got some lovely songs queued up, which I hope you'll enjoy. Hopefully there's no voice changing like there was last time, which was a bit odd and strange and resulted in quite a bit of hilarious laughter. But we'll see how this goes. My first selection, I'm going to do I Could Have Danced All Night. It says Julie Andrews, but that wasn't who did it. <coughs> This was on, um, My Fair Lady, and that definitely wasn't Julie Andrews. I can't think of her name right. Someone's mower just backfired. Oh, Audrey Hepburn, that was her name. So I don't know why it says Julie Andrews. And there's another one, so it should be an interesting. There might be a few dogs in the background barking, but that's okay. So here we go. I even have a lovely microphone today. <laughs> Let's turn that on. One day I'll have this as a seamless process. Oh look, there's a train in the background. That's, that's great. That's great. That's just great. Hello, hello. To find, to find that I am out of my mind. I couldn't have planned that better. That's what you get for living beside the train tracks. We'll just turn the echo off a little bit. Echo! Echo! That is going to be the best function ever on a karaoke machine is the echo. That is the sole purpose of having it. Because otherwise, you're just making yourself louder. But with the echo, you can sound otherworldly. Yes, yes you can. But we'll see how this goes. I might have to wait for the train to pass, though. I don't know if you can hear it or not. It's quite loud over here. If there was an earthquake and a train was going by at the same time, that would be epic. Of course, you know, we're in Ohio, so I doubt, you know, that would ever happen. Because if there was an earthquake, you know, the train would probably, you know, tumble off the tracks. Like, you know, Bob the Builder would have to come and, like, fix it. And for some reason, when I look at the camera, my eyes are, like, over there. Even though I'm looking right at it. I love Echo. It's just so much fun. You are master volume. Yes, we do. Okay, let's see what we're going for. Then, then, I couldn't go to bed. My head's too high to try to set it down. Sleep, sleep. I couldn't sleep tonight, not for all the jewels in my crown. I could have danced all night, I could have danced all night, and still have begged for more. I could have spread my wings and done a thousand things. I What made it so exciting? Why all it was my heart to flight? I only know when you began to dance with me, I could have danced, danced, danced. I could have danced all night, I could have danced all night, and still have begged for more. I could have spread my wings, and done a thousand things I've never done before. 
never know what made it so exciting. Why all at once my heart to cry? I only know when he began to die. Quite a lovely day today, I, I must say. I, I, I went to a, a job thing today, and instead they didn't send the forms in yet, so I have to go back tomorrow. But I had a lovely trip into town, you all got all dressed up and pretty. Now I have to figure out a different outfit to wear, because you know, I only have a few. And I'm always afraid that, you know, they're gonna remember what I wore like the first time they saw me. I'm like, they're like, oh my gosh, she only had like three shirts. <laughs> that, that could happen. I mean, I usually don't remember what people wear, but like if you wear like the same thing every day for like a week, I might notice that you're wearing the same thing. I might. But I mean, I'd have to see you every day and actually pay attention. Yeah. But yes, I do hope everyone's looking okay today and I can see my kitchen back there. I think the most pronounced thing I can see back there is the horseshoe. And maybe the little handle of the sink or arm. I'm not sure what you would call that. But at least my hair doesn't look that bad. It's actually kind of fluffy. But you know, if I was going somewhere, it would look a wreck. It would be flat as a pancake. It's like, no, we shan't let you look lovely today. You will go out looking like a ragamuffin, whether you like it or not. I usually just throw it in a bandana and call it a day. But you know, you can't put a bandana in your hair and just go to, you know, like your future employer. That's like going there in your house slippers and going, I'm ready to work now. I'm going to shuffle on through the back room, creating static as I go. But yeah, yes. <clears throat> I'd have my hair to clip, but then it makes my face look larger than it is, and I don't need that. Yeah. But yeah, it's, it's like 80, 85 degrees today, quite toasty. I did not expect it to get that hot. Of course, we had, you know, eight months of winter, so... We're kind of enjoying it. <sighs> yes. Also thought about redecorating one day. I think I might do that. I think I might do everything in a primitive style throughout the whole house and not have every single room have a different style. Just to make it all, like, uniform. Wouldn't that be wonderful? Quite wonderful indeed. Yes, yes it would. I also have my swords up for sale, if, if anybody would like to buy them. I could use the extra cash. I'm open up for offers on all of those items. That was my clip flipping around. I'm just happy the dogs are all behaving today. But yes, for my next selection, my next selection, I'm going to do Bette Midler The Road. I love his echo. I can sing of someone who falls. Now back to the song. Let's see. I was good. I got them all queued up. So we, we, we should have no problems. Be that down. <clears throat> I love when they put the key of C. Like I even know what that means. Some say love, it is a river that drowns the tender. Some say love, it is a razor that leads your soul to me. Some say love, it is a hunger, and endless aching. 
I say, love, it is a flower, and you, it's all we see. It's the heart of rain, a breaking that never to dance it's the dream afraid of waking that never takes a chance hello hello it's the one who won't be taken who can and a soul afraid of dying that never learns to live. When the night has been too lonely, and the road has been too long and you think that love is only for the lucky and the strong just remember in the winter Far beneath the bitter snow lies the sea that with the sun's love in the spring becomes the went rather well didn't it aside from you know walking cat you know but you know, you can't plan for these things you know you can't tell well i'm sorry mummy's recording you have to stay in the window he kind of you know just goes as he pleases yeah i'm also trying to sell you know a few bowls and things so yeah if you need to buy you know, of it i would be very much appreciative but yes I'm not as talkative as I was on the other video. I think I was like just on a bloody rant last time, but that's okay. But I did have fun picking all kinds of lovely songs. I also like that my camera phone, well, the camera on my phone actually shows how much time has passed. Because when I did the webcam, it was like, all of a sudden I had like 35 minutes and I had no idea that I had spoken that long. It was insane. It took YouTube like, half an hour to load that thing because it was so long and then I had to do an authorization that it sent to my email to make sure that I wanted to post it to make sure I was allowed I don't know why you'd have to get sent an email type in the code you got from the email just so you could be approved to load a video that that seems kind of you know ridiculous Ugh. And of course my allergies are awful. I'm sure a lot of you could share in the sympathies of that. But yeah, my heart is so lovely today. I'm just so proud of it. Oh. But yes. It's a funny thing. Just sitting here talking to the world. The world beyond. Beyond. Next time I have a house, I want it surrounded by woods and my nearest neighbor, it needs to be like a mile away. There's like someone outside with a chainsaw right now. It's kind of scary. And I think my neighbor is cutting down a tree again. She just will bear the whole bunch of stuff. And now it's on the side. 
She also mows her grass during the winter, so it's kind of freaky. Which makes my grass look like 100 feet tall because she never gives it a chance to grow. But you're gonna have neighbors like that, but that's okay. I feel like I need to like impart some kind of wisdom at this point, but I forgot my book. Yes, I have a book with like all these lovely yoga gems that are like food for thought. But I guess I could look up something. I could look up something. I never typed in yoga gems before. Yoga gems. I'll probably get jewelry or something. It's like I love typing in random stuff and you're like, oh my gosh, I had no idea. We're loading, we're loading, we're loading, we're loading, we're still loading. Seriously, we're still, we're still loading. We're still loading. I do love meditation though. Meditation is quite, quite a lot of fun. I don't do it as often as I, I should. Otherwise I'd be a lot calmer and a lot more collected and more sophisticated. Sophisticated. <laughs> I just realized I have uh, another dot on the bottom of the phone. I think I can take a picture. <laughs> it's not interesting. But I'm too afraid I'll knock over the phone. I can like push it like in the air. Oh my gosh, it's still loading. Why? Oh, there it is. A treasury of practical and spiritual wisdom. Spiritual wisdom. My neighbor's probably freaking out trying to figure out where this noise is coming from, but I have to have the window open, otherwise we'll suffocate. Uh, I don't want that. I don't want that. Maybe we should have put... We'll just put this down for a minute. I need both hands to type. Let's see. Uplifting... Enlightenment. I am not the best of spellers, so sometimes it takes me a while to sound out. Oh, okay. Apparently, I misspelled something. Thank the heavens for spell check. <clears throat> Let's see. Change your thoughts, and you change your world. I don't know if I actually believe that. Your experience has taught me otherwise. I suppose if you believed in something enough, blindly, you could pretend that it was actually changed. I don't know if it would actually change. Yes, let's see. Some of these are weird. Like this one. God sleeps in the minerals, awakens in plants, walks in animals, and thinks in man. He is a busy dude, you know? I just, I don't know how I feel about him sleeping in rocks. And every morning he wakes up in a flower. And then during the day he's walking about with animals. And he only uses his brain when he's near humans. That doesn't really sound like a smart practice, you know, because humans really aren't that smart. I mean, sure, we've had our you know, geniuses and everything, but I just, they're, they're, we're a very stupid, stupid species, if you ask me. I mean, look at me, huh? But no, I, I've got reasons for my insanity. Look within. Within is the fountain of good. And it will never bo- Oh. And it will ever bubble up. If thou wilt ever dig. I don't really like digging. And I don't like water, so I guess the fountain of good is completely out. Yes. Gratitude is the fairest blossom which springs from the soul. I must be covered in flowers. 
That's about all it is, but I don't know what, what that's going to do for you, being cut with flowers. It is during our darkest moments that we must focus to see the light. Well, of course you do. I mean, you have to focus because if you've been in the dark all that time, you're going to be squinty. There is nothing stronger in the world than gentleness. I don't know about that. Because, you know, you can say nice things in the middle of the road all you want. That car is still going to hit you. The car doesn't care if you're gentle or not. It's still going to hit you. Let's see. I don't know if I like that. Oh, here we go. Wise quotes. Let's see. You've got a lot of choices. If getting out of bed in the morning is a chore, and you're not smiling on a regular basis, try another choice. I suppose I could levitate out of the bed instead of getting out of it. I mean, should I just stay in it? I don't know. Let's see, if you surrender to the wind, you can ride it. I'm going to go outside right now, say, I surrender, and I want to see if the wind takes me away. I doubt it. I'm, I've lost my magic carpet somewhere. Knowing me, I probably sold it. Let's see. Promise only what you can deliver. Then deliver more than you promise. Ugh. I haven't delivered anything lately. Except for these. Hmm. Oh, I like this one. The essential question is not how busy are you, but what are you busy at? That is the question. And right now I'm busy at this. Hmm. That's lovely. Oh, and I'm gonna also do a Judd's song. I love their music. I haven't actually sang the Judds in quite a long time. I usually listen to the same song over and over on the radio, whatever's on the radio. I have tons of CDs, but they're from like when I was in like high school, a long, long time ago. And they're, they're really not pertinent anymore. Most of them are just, you know, a few soundtracks. I really need a new CD, CD collection. You'd think as obsessed with music, I would have them, but I don't. Oh, who knows? Here we go. Wait, am I on? Yes, I'm on. Here we go. How much I can't do me on. Not too much. Not too much. There we go. Here we go to save the day. I cannot believe the dogs have started barking. <laughs> Must be my day. Key of B. In case anyone cares. I know where I'm going, don't you want to come to? I got my reservation, and I got one for you. Trays are leaving just after dark, there's always room for a loving heart. I know where I'm going, don't you want to come to? I know my destination, it's waiting for me. I got no hesitation, that's where I want to be. By the time that the sun comes up, well, I'll be drinking from a loving cup. I know where I'm going, don't you want to come to? Don't you wanna come? Don't you wanna ride? Don't you wanna be there by my side? Hand in hand, holding on to the sweet salvation that's waiting for me and you. I think I screwed that up. I know why I'm singing. 
Now do one sing to Can't you hear the bells ringing? Let the spirit move Close your eyes and let it flow Lean your head back and let it go I know where I'm going Don't you wanna come to Eight Law Instrumental Break <laughs> Or his mom always says, montage <laughs> Don't you wanna come? Don't you wanna ride? Don't you wanna be there by my side? Hand in hand, holding on to the sweet salvation that's waiting on me and you. I know where I'm going. Don't you wanna come to? I got my reservation And I got one for you I know what I'm saying Don't you want to sing to mm. That was pretty good, wasn't it? It's all to do with loving What else could we sing? I mean, we sung, you know, a little bit of everything. You know, I tried to include lots of songs in my variety show. But yeah, yeah. Right now I'm watching uh, Psych, that series, you know, that they cancelled. Catching up with, I'm almost to the last season. Kind of sad about that. Some series I just wish they would never end. I wish they would keep doing it until the actor dies. They should just do it forever. Like, I was really upset that Being Human got cancelled. That really, really upset me. I don't care, you know, if they stop making the UK. We should be able to make them still in America. Just make up a new story. But no, we have to give up all these, these fabulous things because we might have fabulous shows next year. I don't believe that. I'm the kind of person that gets attached to these characters. You know, they become a part of my weekly ritual. And I get rather sad when they go away. I doubt I'm alone in that sentiment. I guess. I've turned it up all the way. Let's see. I don't know all the words of this song. Oh, Danny boy, the ships, the ships are calling you. Oh, Danny boy, what should I do? Video effects, even so, I can like take out the background and like pretend like I'm on the beach somewhere and match my horrible, awful sunburn that I got. Oh, that is all for this show. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for watching me be silly. Yes, I enjoy being silly on camera. I don't know why. I just do. But thank you for watching the Tabitha Variety Show. Goodbye. <laughs>